it takes me so long to get from point A to point B that I have a lot of time to think. And my parents were from up the road here in northern Arkansas, and they had a saying up there that I've never forgotten. If you find a turtle up on top of a fence post, you can pretty well count on it he didn't get there by himself. <laughs> When this all started, I asked my friend Sam Bailey to start the Western Clinic in Tucson, Arizona to show people we had program, and he did. And then I asked Bill Mead, a friend, to start the one in Fort Lauderdale, Florida to show that we were national in scope. Uh, I asked Jay Ashmore, when we got the first world championship ever outside of Europe, to run it. And I got to do all the talking, and he was the successful one we ever run. Then I was loaned for a while to uh, the United States Collegiate School. What we need is two chartered 707s for 300 athletes in nine sports to meet in Moscow, one from Chicago, one from New York, within 30 minutes of each other. And by the way, two doctors, three nurses, five trainers, and all the equipment. So I called a friend named Bill Sorensen, and the company he was with at that time said, okay, we'll underwrite it all. And then turned around after a very successful World University Games in Moscow and paid for the World University Winter Games in Lake Placid that we also ran. The reason I mention some of these people is every one of those men who helped me is on the board of this Hall of Fame. And you can imagine why we asked them to be on. Then we had men like Frank Endo, who has done so much for the country of Japan's relationships with the United States that the country of Japan is seeking to honor him for more than 50 years of encouraging cooperation between the two countries. My friend Hans-Peter Frey, who will be up here soon from uh, Switzerland, uh, we've known each other many, many years, and uh, he's been such a help to us in Europe when we need to contact people there. I think by the time we get this organization really on its feet, uh, you'll all be very much proud of what's been done so far and what will be done in the future. The, uh, the one thing I would like to say, I have to, by the way, I want to thank all the people in the room, and there are a bunch who for the last 10 years have pushed me up on ramps, helped me down, helped me on airplanes, picked me up when I've fallen once in a while, and lifted me out of a thousand chairs. Because uh, I want you to know, as surely as I'm here, if this is the top of the fence pole for me, I didn't get here by myself. Thank you very much.